What's up, everybody? It's your boy Kennedy Daily back with another episode of the Young Let's Sew. In this episode, we are going to be experimenting with cardigans, especially long line cardigans, and that's pretty much what the episode is going to be about. Now, before I actually jump into the episode, I just want to say, are you guys having a good one? Are you having that A1 day? Let me know in the comment section below. Anyways, let's jump straight into the episode. We back. Back again. Ken is back. Let's sew again. Okay, that was really bad. Anyways, so we back. And today I'm going to be making a long line cardigan. Something that I was planning a long time ago. A lot of people have been hitting me up. Yo, Ken and you daily. Where is the young cardigans at? I'm trying to look that young gentleman fly right now. So, of course, I've been just so busy with other projects, my clothing line, picking. And, you know, I've always talked about that. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to take a step back and just make something that people were kind of looking forward to. So I just want to apologize in advance that it took me forever to get to this. But since I made the pattern, as you guys see in the video, it's going to come relatively soon now i need some feedback because if you guys watched my last from scratch i i don't really consider a from scratch it's like the valentine's day diy if you guys found that pattern kind of helpful let me know because i'm kind of going in that direction where i'll make patterns put it on my blog spot let people use it let people view it for free that's it they can make their own piece of clothing the reason why I don't want to integrate that into the video is because it creates a very lengthy video and I don't know if that's something people like, people don't like. I would love some feedback on that if you guys can uh, give that A1 advice for me, the A1 criticism as well. Please be sure to drop that down below. Since we are on that topic about feedback and connecting with everyone here on the tubes, I don't want you guys to feel intimidated or feel weird to ask me questions. We all fam right here. You guys are my brothers, my sisters, or whatever you're trying to be to me. It's all love here on the channel. So if you have a question, if you need some advice, I don't know what you're trying to ask, but I got you. Like, I love you guys to death. You guys are my family. So please, if you have a comment, a question about sewing, about anything, hit me up. You can always follow me on the uh, the young IGs. Hit me up in the DMs. Slide into them DMs, and uh, just hit me up. Like I'm down to just talk. If you're trying to if trying to snap me, like hit me up too. At at Kenny Daily. Shameless plug right there. Anyways, talking about the actual cardigan itself, I'm working with this rayon material, rayon viscose, something like that. It's like a rayon material. It's very light. It's very stretchy, and it's very messy to work with. Now, if you've ever worked with rayon or anything like this, you just know it curls up, literally curls up like it's 4 a.m. in the morning. You don't have a blanket, so you gotta get in that young fetal position, trying to warm yourself up. It curls that hard. Not even ironing down the, the, the material is enough sometimes. So working with this material is probably the hardest, and I just wanna put that first and foremost if you're trying to make a cardigan yourself using this material. So just try to, you know, keep it calm, you know, try to listen to some really calm Mozart type trap flavored feeling music. Now getting into the design concept of the long line cardigan. For guys, it's kind of weird. It's kind of like a fine line between what is interesting, what is weird and what is acceptable. Now, to be honest, I don't care about any of that stuff. I'm Ken Andy Daily. I'm going to do what I feel I like. So for the length of the long line cardigan, I decided, yo, let's just make it as long as I can with the material that I have. So that's why it's very, very long when you saw it in the beginning of the video. Another thing that you probably couldn't catch in the beginning of the video is that I made the cardigan asymmetrical in the front. One side of the cardigan can overlap the other side just because of the way I sewed on the mid strip. Low key, I literally took that concept from, actually high key, I took that concept from Naragi's. So shout outs to the Naragi's one time. All right, so now that we got all that in the way, I, I'm about to be zero to 100 real quick because 
It's just something on my mind. I want to let you guys in on what's going on. And like I said earlier, you're my fam, and I want you guys in on everything. Be as transparent as possible. Now, when you guys saw, or if you guys saw my Valentine's video that I did with my friend, you guys were all confused because like, yo, who is this? Didn't you have a girlfriend? What's going on? So, if you guys have been rocking with me for a while, you know that my girlfriend was always in my videos. We were together for a long time. I was, we were, we were A1. But, unfortunately things happen. We had to go our separate ways and things were mutual. Like, I'm still cool with her. She's still in my life to an extent. And what's so crazy about being with someone for so long is just like, ah! why you know you you kind of you get into that comfort zone where it's like i really miss the person but i hope the best for the person what the heck do i do so to kind of sum things up me and my ex are cool and you guys probably are questioning like what's good what's going on through heartbreak and through fixing things it really helped me get to the point where i am as far as designing as far as making clothing and I want you guys to understand that everything in life you can bring back to what you love doing. Whether it be heartbreak or whether it be an accomplishment, it doesn't matter. You just want to make sure that you take all that energy, whether it be negative, positive, it doesn't matter. And channel that into something you love. And you'll see how much it brings out the best in you and it's, it's crazy. That's all I'm going to really say about that. I know we got the young feels up in this bizatch but let's let's move it on <laughs> now it's time for the young comment of the day and the comment comes from joseph james and he writes andrew where do you get the templates for your clothing do you design it yourself printing etc i do everything from scratch here on my youtube channel i don't i rarely use books i don't use patterns from stores i make everything and it's been a while since I've done it from scratch video and the reason why is because I felt like my patterns weren't up to par with standards so that's why I've been doing let's sews. I don't know if you watched my first let's sew or anything like that but that's why I have been just practicing 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 these let's sews are coming out almost every week just because once I figure out everything I want to go back into my from scratch videos with the knowledge and with the experience that I got from my let's sews. So when you guys do your own pattern, you already know like, yo, this is what he did and this is really what is good and really what works. So I make all my patterns to make it short and sweet and I make all my clothing short and sweet. And will I be selling these patterns? I don't know yet. Short and sweet. I know you saw this video already, but if you guys want another look of the long line cardigan on body, here it is again. Now I just want to give a special thanks as always to the boy Evan for always coming through with the young cinematic views of what I do for my let's so So special thanks to him. If you have not checked out his channel, please, I'll put his link down below anyways that's the video hope you guys enjoyed it this is your boy ken and you daily remember to keep it daily remember having an a1 day and i hope to catch you guys next time peace yeah.